Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Timmy Turtle. Uh, we've been in Brisbane over Christmas and been trying to do some videos but haven't been catching much. Caught a couple of fish yesterday, one the camera wasn't on for. Yep. Oh! I think we got a thready. I thought I'd come up into the shallows. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Might be a trev. I have no idea. Got one flatty this morning, forgot to turn the camera on. Yeah, camera's on, all good. If we've got a thready, that's what we come out here for. That's, that'd be amazing. I was about to head back. Oh, oh, oh. It's gotta be a trev. You're kidding, is that a snapper? No way. It's like a snapper or a squire or... <laughs> Look at that! My first... Is it a snapper? I'm not sure. Wow. Didn't expect that at all. Yeah, we're back out of the Port of Brisbane today. I came out here yesterday, thought I was gonna get arrested. Actually ran into the cops, didn't get arrested, so that was amazing. I'm about to get in trouble by the cops here. Uh, get a photo and we'll put it up on the wall at work. <laughs> it's functional, it works, so. Gets me on the water. I normally you down around the Gold Coast area. Does it go with a bit of, uh, like a bit of swell or a bit of water? Oh, it's, it's not the easiest. You, you tend to rock around a bit. Yeah, See you later, have a good day. So now we're back out here, seeing as it's legit. Some boys told me about a spot where they got some jewies yesterday, so thought I'd give it a crack. It's gonna take me about four hours to get to the spot, but we should get there with just enough sunlight to see if we can get one. Be good to get one on Pipe Dream. Never know what's gonna happen. So again, another early start. Let's see if we can get something before we head back down to Gold Coast. So we've got both cameras on today, even though that one's still blurry. If I get hit by a ship, really want it to be on camera. You know, either this one or that one. My battery didn't charge fully from yesterday, so I have the paddle on board. I don't think I'm gonna make it through today without the battery going dead. Hoping just to stay in the one spot. Derek, the legend, left me some maps on Facebook last night and said fish here. We're gonna go to the one spot, fish it till eight o'clock and then cry and then go back home. If this thing run over me, I'd probably have a chance of surviving. Yeah, I'd fit down there. Right, the rock should be somewhere around here. It's taken us 22 minutes to get here. I think we found the rock, got some coral. It's gonna be a little bit difficult to do this without a depth sounder. I'm just gonna throw a little three inch minnow. Oh, just got my first hit. Well, we're in the right place. I reckon you should jig vertical, but I don't really have a sounder. So I'm not really sure if I'm jigging on the right spot. So I'm just gonna cast out and slowly retrieve with the current along where I think it should be. Classic Tim. Never do stuff the easy way. Come on, just one Dewey. This is gonna be difficult with all these boats going past. I think yesterday was a bit calmer than this. It's days like this when I wish I just had a, invested in a proper boat. It's definitely more rewarding if you get a fish the hard way. Gotta risk it to get the biscuit. Oh, feels like a flatty. Oh. oh, look at that. My first cod. You beauty. Well, I'm in the right area. I'm on the rocks. There we go, nice little cod. This one's a brown striped, red spotted cod. No, seriously, I don't know what, it, what sort of cod it is. So, do you know what it is? Leave a comment. Because I'm not, oh, there he goes. It wasn't really the big one we we're after. To avoid being tacky, your lure actually go down and camouflage itself. The time I get off this boat, I'm gonna have hips like Shakira. I never really knew that she could dance like this. She make a man wanna speak Spanish. Come on, see our si, bonita si. Shikasha, Shakira, Shakira. Oh, baby, when you talk like that, you make a woman go mad. Oh, check this out, guys. Big piano cruiser. That's incredible. Look at the size of that. How does that thing float? How many PVC piping would it take to make that thing float? <laughs> Steady yourself, people. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oh, 
that's a big wash. We didn't lose anything. I don't know what that is, but that's a new PB. Oh, I stopped with the flicking and started the slow rolling just across the bottom. I don't know what we have. Another one of those brown striped red spotted estuary cod, maybe? Hey, at least we're catching something. Hope I haven't confused it with the world's deadliest fish. Gee, they're a pretty looking fish. See you later, mate. Yep, oh, that's a good fish. Oh, Woo, he hit it on the draw. Oh, that's a, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, 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 no. He might have me bricked. No, he's still there, he's still there. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. That is a good fish. He hit that on the drop. Stay on. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This gets a bit tricky. Yeah, boy. I caught my first one yesterday and now I've got another one. I think the bloke said pink brim, snapper, squire, I don't know. If you caught a few of them, that'd be a good feed. There we go. See you later, man. Well, it wasn't as good as I thought. It's two fish in a couple of minutes. Actually, that was the very next cast. I nearly ended up in the drink trying to get that fish. Still have this faint hope that we can upgrade. Gonna stay out here a bit longer. Even though I know I'm pushing it with the battery. I might be paddling home. As a, as a fishing YouTuber, I should probably know what the fish are that I'm catching. <laughs> oh well, I'm sure you guys will help me out as I go along. Those little snapper put up a good fight. I thought he was much bigger than that. Not sure I'm allowed to be doing this, but it's the easiest way through. back down the Gold Coast now so we'll be jumping on the water getting some new jacks. I'm generally surprised we didn't end up in the loony bin after <laughs> that weekend's of fishing. If you have enjoyed this episode give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe. Pretty much mapped out that whole area with my lure, dragging the lure across the bottom. I knew every rock and crevice um, after casting so many times. I did shift around a majority of the coral though so they're all in new places. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you next episode.